my talented fighter making the walk here tonight. I will be surprised, Joe, if we see him put on his back at any point tonight. Incredible takedown defense, great balance, very solid base, an outstanding sprawl that's very quick and athletic. And for a lot of fighters, they waste a lot of energy trying to bring this man down. Got to think the smart approach will be to see if you can get the shot early, but if it doesn't materialize, go to plan B. This guy's takedown defense north of 90%. Some of the best takedown artists in the world have failed to take him down. If there's one thing you have to watch out for from Chuck Liddell, it's the overhand right. He has very solid takedown defense and very solid takedowns of his own, but he likes to keep the fight standing and throw those legendary punches of his. So here is Conor McGregor making the walk once again, and to say he has put Dublin, Ireland on the MMA map has got to be the understatement of the century. McGregor has vaulted into superstardom, former UFC featherweight champion, UFC lightweight champion, the only simultaneous two-division champion, and has become the biggest superstar mixed martial arts has ever seen in UFC history. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan-favorite combination. for this, our main event of the evening. More than five years apart. Some differences in height and reach as well. All right, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment you and some fans around waiting for live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas it's time five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division introducing first fighting out of the blue corner this man is a kickboxer only a professional record of 18 wins 8 losses he stands 62 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of San Luis Obispo, California, presenting the member of the UFC Hall of Fame and the former UFC light heavyweight champion of the world, the This man is a kickboxer, only a professional record of 21 wins, three losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the notorious Connor McGregor! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. This, this has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in because it's about to go down right now. Ready. And we are underway. All right, early action here. Oh! That one hurt. Oh, oh man, he's got him right here. Oh, 
first. Yeah, Joe, we're just getting going, and there's the end of the fight. So it's a win by first round knockout. Near perfect on the technique. I'm not even sure his opponent saw that thing coming. And really, before his opponent had a chance to get in the fight at all and land anything in terms of a significant strike, he was knocked out. So major, major transpiration here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. Take a look at this from a different angle. Boom! And he's out. And there he is after a massive knockout here tonight. Near perfect execution and a seminal moment for him here in the Octagon tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop for this contest at 35 seconds in the very first round. To find the winner by knockout, the notorious Conor McGregor! Well, what a legacy it has been for the two-division UFC champion Conor McGregor, and he only adds to it here tonight as he gets his hand raised yet again. Doubt this man at your own peril, ladies and gentlemen. It seems like every time the doubters get on board, Connor finds a way to mute them all, and he does exactly that here tonight. Another massive, massive win for the future UFC Hall of Famer, the notorious Connor McGregor.